very good afternoon viewers and welcome back once again to fan code emirates d10 2024 powered by seven districts well we're all set and in readiness for this important encounter between team emirates blue and team dubai that's the news from the center then emirates blues they won the toss and akif raja their captain elected to bat first Right then, we're all set and in readiness for day three, match number one. Ronak Panoli to start off, ball number one. Oh, straight away, some drifter in the air. Wow, that was a good delivery. Zainullah free his arms. Played up Ishli, and that will be the first boundary of the innings. Zainullah. Winning the toss, selecting to bat first emirates blues that was in the slot and that's been hammered yusuf gets his first boundary for emirates blues miss out an opportunity especially yusuf and zainullah very good batters they're operating spin from both the ends half tracker yet again clears the infield no straight into the hands of the fielder the first wicket down for emirates blues a wonderful catch Brilliant bowling, just adjusting his length, saw the batter coming down the track, an excellent catch. Shahrukh, well, he's a very safe fielder, he's not going to drop that. Yusuf, a sorry departure, he was looking very comfortable in the middle, literally just threw his wicket. He'll have to depart after scoring just the five runs in five deliveries. Well, he certainly is, and as we speak, he walks down the wicket and deposits one into the stands. That will be one bounce for Oh, what a beautiful stroke. And that is out of here. What a magnificent blow that was coming from the blade of Aryan Saxena. If they both get going, they can look out for a big score. It yet again goes big straight down the ground and that will be a boundary for Zainullah. Runs coming from both the ends. For Team Emirates Blues. This was in the slot. That's been hammered. Fielder will only be a mere spectator. A maximum coming from the blade of Zainullah. This is good to see. It's going to challenge the fitness of the players. And that has been hit really hard. And one bounce into the boundary. Another brilliant prospect. Half tracker yet again. And that's been hammered for a maximum. Not the greatest of the start. And Zainullah is looking extremely dangerous out there. Going always away from him. Yet again slammed. And that will be another boundary. Well, 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 we are here for a good show. A blockbuster. Dances down the track. And that is long and high and out of here. What a brilliant hit coming in from the blade of Aryan. Yet again goes big. This is looking mighty, mighty big. And that is a maximum to finish the over. Three maximums coming in that over and a oh, wonderful stadium. Well, he's knocked him over, trying to fabricate a shot, a full toss on offer and missed by Aryan. Was trying to go towards the fine leg region only to find the timber. Well, I'm not sure that if he wants to have a look at that replay, Aryan, when he goes back. That was a very <laughs> ugly shot, I must say. He was looking so comfortable in the middle, but literally just threw his wicket away. It was a juicy, juicy full toss. And he just got himself into a very awkward position. Goes big. He decides the other way around. This was in the slot. And Zainullah accepts it gracefully. Well, well, well. What a day Zainullah is having. Shuffling across. Played it uppishly in the gap. And that is going towards the boundary. And it will trickle. So this is... A very good shot here by Yusayed. He saw that width provided by Angad. Played a magnificent knock. Dances down the track. That is long. That is huge. And that is a monstrous hit once again. What a way to bring his half century. Well played, young man. Or struck hard. Uh, what a brilliant hit. And that is out of here. This is terrific stuff. That will give them a lot of confidence and yet again clearing that inner circle with ease Zainullah another boundary added to the total well he's looking 
team scoring this target and making it difficult for the opponents. And that is going to be another maximum. What a brilliant strike once again. I will say Waited for that and hit that out of the park. Or cut that hard. And this too is going towards the boundary. So this is turning out to be another expensive hole for Nilanj. Well, it's knocked him over. Finally, some redemption for Nilanj. Well, that was a straighter delivery. That was a good delivery. Just right on the stumps and knocked the middle stump of Usaid. Played a good cameo, a very helpful knock, I must say. Came in early and played 14 deliveries and has scored a very good handy knock. Ethan D'Souza, new man. Straight away going in the air and has fallen into the vacant area. So that will be the end of the innings for Emirates Blues. They've put up a, a very good score on board. With the pace from Bilal, he would be eyeing at those areas. Then comes in Bilal. Slow one to start off with. This is exactly what is known for. And immediately, you can see that movement as well from Hazrat Bilal. Oh, he slashed that towards that point region. And that will be his first maximum. What a terrific hit. Especially when you're up against Hazrat Bilal. And that slash slashed hard over the gully region for a boundary. They've got those runs that they have desired for despite those dot deliveries. Youngster Harsh Desai up against some top-notch batters. Cuts away, finding the gap, bisecting the point and the cover region for a boundary. Well, interesting to see how Ronak will combat him. Goes downtown, one bounce into the fence, over the extra cover region. Ronak Panoli for you. Took a bit of time initially, but he's finding the meat of the bat. Dib always is in the run column. Run fest happening here. Maximum for Ronak Ponoli. You cannot afford to bowl. Uh, I'm not quite sure of the decision taken there by Akif Raja. Another one. Copy and paste. It's just that it's been hit in a different direction over the extra cover region. Go straight downtown. Ronak Ponoli is having a wonderful time today. This was in the slot yet again and Ronak Panoli pounces on it like a ferocious tiger. But what Emirates Blues need is wickets. Hit hard and the fielder will be a mere spectator. Another boundary count added to the tally of the team Dubai. So nine runs given in the four deliveries. Akif Raja steaming in and that has been guided towards the fine leg. No stopping that. Third boundary of the over. Great dexterity, sweet connection. We'll have the time will tell and Hardik Pai, another one in the slot and this opportunity has been taken. Hardik Pai of the first delivery has picked up the price scalp of Ram Ronak Panoli. And Ronak Panoli, well, he was looking very dangerous. It was a very good shot, but just couldn't find that elevation and hit that throat, hit that rather straight into the throat of the fielder. He's not going to drop that. Very good fiery innings coming in from Ronak Panoli. Good catch there by Yusuf and Ronak Panoli departs after scoring 38 of 17 deliveries. Walks in and straight away he goes up edge. That is long in the air. Oh, what a catch. He's taken an absolute stunner here. Well, this is a blinder. Atta off the first delivery, trying to go big over the long off region. Just could not hold on to it and a... A wonderful catch in this context of the game. Falling in quick succession. This is why I love the shortest format of the game, the S10. Well, how well the tables have turned and have a look at that catch. Brilliant. The youngster has picked up a memorable catch. He will not forget this for ages. Well, a sorry departure. Atar Rahman departs after scoring not 44 for the loss of two. Go straight downtown Amar and that will be a maximum. After those two wickets on the trot. 
or he slammed that towards the long on and that is a huge maximum up and over ramiz will have to fire as we speak he did that the first maximum in that over ramesh says are taking the responsibility his second over is bowling with that right hand well that is high in the air and six runs that is what is required for team dubai slow one clear trying to clear the inner circle straight into the hands of the fielder and another one bites the dust for team dubai amar just not reading that variation coming in from akif and straight into the hands of the fielder well he's been very smart with his variations and a very good catch here by asif amar just couldn't get that elevation and that timing but he's played a very good innings once again or oh, straight away he goes big what a brilliant strike that is that is what you require sharukh sheikh he's just walked in slow one and that has been hit for a boundary one bounce into the fence almost there short delivery pull and that will be a boundary we'll have to wait for the empire's call yes it is a boundary but i was wondering if that is one for the over no that's a legal delivery full toss and just it's just going to be a single and in the end it's emirates blues who have won this contest excellent display of cricketing skills from both the teams